Hello, and welcome to 5 Facts About the IP Address, the means by which all devices are identified on a network such as the Internet. Like any good delivery system, proper addressing is important, and computer networks are no different. They share information and resources. Modern communication systems, for decades, have been relying on a series of protocols known as TCP IP. Packaged into this suite is the Internet Protocol, or IP address. The IP address is just a string of numbers that is given to a device connected to a network. And the address is divided into two parts, with a subnet mask differentiating one from the other. On the left, you have what is known as a network ID. These numbers represent the local network where the device is currently residing. Think of this as the Internet's version of a zip code. Moving to the right of the address, you'll find the host ID. Like the number on a building, the host ID represents the device itself. For data to be transmitted across the network, it must first be prepared. This entails breaking the data down into pieces and placing the pieces into containers. One of these containers is known as the IP packet. The IP packet is labeled with two sets of IP addresses, one for the source of the data and the other for its destination. It is the destination IP address that routers along the way will compare with their routing tables to plot a path for the packet. Here's a quick overview. Using the network's ID, routers are able to narrow down the local network where the packet needs to go. Once that is done, the destination device can now be identified through the host ID. There are two versions of the IP address that are currently in use. IPv4 was first deployed in 1983. It is 32 bits long and can support just over 4 billion devices. The address itself is made up of four 8-bit segments known as octets that can range anywhere from 0 to 254. By the 1990s, with the rise of the World Wide Web, it was first seen that IPv4 would be incapable of accommodating the ever-growing number of internet devices. And so, plans were made for a new version of the Internet Protocol. IPv6 is the latest version of the Internet Protocol. It was built to rectify the shortcomings of IPv4. With an address length of 128 bits, IPv6 can accommodate an unimaginable number of devices, future-proofing this version for the foreseeable future. But the benefits do not end there. With security protocols like IPsec integrated into IPv6, we can now be more at ease when performing transactions online that may require sensitive information. Here are some additional facts. IP addresses generally fall within one of two categories, private or public. Private addresses are unregulated and can only be used within a local network. Public addresses, on the other hand, are regulated and can be used for internet transmissions. Unlike the MAC address, which tends to remain the same for the lifetime of a device, the IP address will most likely change, especially if the device is moved to a different network. Even though its demise has been talked about for the past three decades, IPv4 has stood the test of time due to implementations such as network address translation. So there it is, five facts about IP addresses. Do you have a question or a fact you would like to add? Leave a comment below. And if you like the video, please give it a like and consider subscribing if you're not. Thank you for watching and see you in the next one.